Gary Fish 360 is happening people um, this is a Red Texas update on my guys on my Red Texas on my 7 foot this is one of them that's peeling ain't the greatest response if I've been honest I'm not a great fan of him but he is peeling my other one that's peeling this guy here but which again another one which ain't got a lot of spots same as this big guy here he's got spots at the back bit to me I'll say it's another dud got another one here this one had no spots it's just getting spots it's getting bigger which I find really strange but my best contenders red Texas is these guys look at the spots on that I'm so I hope that turns red and peels like that guy there another red Texas here so this one's gone through the dark stage another red Texas there Load of spots on the back on that one there, but not around the face. Where's my other red Texas? There's another one down there. So this one's nice, but loads of spots. So hopefully that one peels. No one up here. Sorry about the reflection on my phone, peeps. Where's my bad boy red Texas? There's one up here. Here we go, you ready people? This is my best red Texas I've got and I so hope this peels. This one's gangster. Come on camera, it's reflecting. It's only reflecting because look, I've got a gap between there, the light's coming, that's better. I can see him now. This is the best red Texas that I have. Look at the spots on that. He's yeah, super nice. He's swimming over there, doing his thing. I think I've got about 10 red Texas in this tank at the moment. I'll say five of them. Oh no, I'll say more than five, I'll say about seven to eight are really nice. The rest of them, mm. I wish I had a fish that was big enough that I could eat them. I don't think they're worth nothing. But yeah, this is my Red Texas. Where are you guys going? Back to the main one at first. This is a Red Texas update. I'll keep you people in tune.